different cultural communities. We saw this ourselves. Uh, in Canada, for example, there's some small cities where it's primarily uh, Italian-focused. Vaughan and Woodbridge are ones that are close to our hearts, where there's so many Italian people that prefer to do business in Italian if they can. But what we see here, sorry, let me just uh, find it here, the top five cultural communities. We've identified five languages here, Vietnamese, Czech, Pennsylvania, Dutch, Slovak, and Spanish, where there's a large percentage of people in each one of these communities who speak that language. So yes, the majority of them can speak in English, but what we know is that if you can communicate in your own language, you have a very different experience. So because we come from this multilingual background and that multilingual service offering on the app, this is just another benefit that we can provide for these individuals. Specifically with regard, as I said, to the credit unions, what we notice is that people who are coming from abroad, these cultural communities, have a tendency to stick together, and that's exactly why the majority of them actually bank with credit unions. Because I bank with a credit union, you bank with a credit union, we share that experience and we're part of that close-knit community. So by targeting credit unions in particular, this is a very unique offering for us with the language aspect.